Y'all, this is Master P. I just want to tell y'all, subscribe to Piper Boy Williams, your verified source of battle rap and entertainment. You heard me? Listen to me. You know what I'm saying? I want to talk to y'all real quick. Hold on for a minute. Wait a minute. What's the hold on? Wait. So I want to say this though, right? Shout out to everybody. It's a couple things I want to talk about. First thing I do want to say, if you missed the last live, I talked about a couple of things. One of the things I talked about, and I see people starting to talk about it, Rum Nitty, <laughs> he kind of got played. You know, so Foots got a lot more time, like in his, I guess his grace period and his round time. I don't know. He got way more time than Rum Nitty, you know, in the contract. Some people saying like, yo, because I think Rum Nitty got like 90, 90 second rounds and you know what I'm saying? Like a... A, a smaller grace period than what, you know, Foots got. I don't know, you know, so some people saying like, yo, Rum Nitty shouldn't have signed a contract, but at the same time, like how would Rum Nitty know, you know, whether or not like his opponent had the same time, you know what I'm saying? Like you're supposed to have the same time limits, you know what I mean? So I don't know. I feel like that's a discrepancy. Something happened. Somebody needs to talk. You know, I see that Foots is, he's going public about it. And, you know, for somebody to, to quote unquote, get a, a win off of Rum Nitty. This is where everybody say, I don't know, I ain't see the battle yet. You know, but Rum Nitty's mad, he's talking. For for Foots to, you know, allegedly get a win against Rum Nitty and at the URL and telling them that he wants to redo the battle, it's kind of saying something. You know, he's saying like, yo, I don't want to win like this. You know, I want to run it back with bro. He wants to battle again and, and with the proper time limits. Y'all tell me what y'all think down in the comment section below i don't understand how something like that can happen you know what i mean like obviously you know things can happen in contracts and when y'all have been doing battles this long like how does a foot you know what i mean foots get more time than rum i don't know i think it's a setup i don't believe nothing wait a minute <laughs> I kind of think, it's, I mean, that don't make no sense, bruh. You know, and I do want to say this. A person like Rum Nitty, you know, you got to, y'all got to understand, like, when Rum Nitty is taking all these battles, like, we hear what Lux is saying, like, oh, well, you know, you battling too much and all that. A person like Rum Nitty is very much needed in battle rap. You know, he's a fan favorite. A lot of people rock with him. He's got a high win percentage on the app. You know what I'm saying? He's just got a lot of fans. You know, so if you're going to be battling somebody like that, that's got a crazy pen and people like to, you know what I mean, hear what he got to say, you're going to be seen, you know, and you want to, you know, have your best performance. And I guess Foots has the best performance just the times was off. You know what I mean? So I don't know. You know what I mean? Y'all tell me what y'all think. But at the same time, Rum Nitty, this is, you battle so much, things can happen. You know, you can take losses like you lost to Ilmac. Like you, some people saying you lost to Jazz. I got you winning against Jazz. I think you won the second and the third round. Her first round was crazy. You know what I mean? Her third round was all right too. You know, but some people saying like you lost that. I don't think you lost that battle. But you know, if you lost against Foots, you know what I mean, and then you you lost against Ilmac. You know, and some people say you lost against Ace. I think you 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 won that battle. You know what I'm saying? But it's just you know people are starting to to question whether or not you're winning some of these battles because you battling a lot, you know? So when, like, I understand what Lux is saying to an extent, like you don't want to battle out, you know what I mean? But at the same time, like a person like Rum Nitty, if he's not in the field and he's not battling and he's not giving people opportunities, who else is going to give him the opportunities? You know what I'm saying? I mean, Tay Rock going to battle everybody. It is what it is. Wait a minute. Shout out to Rock. I rock with you. I, 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 all right, Rock, I quit. Unblock me. And I ain't going to beat you up. Shout out. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Tayra. I don't know. Like, I heard that. Hold on. Before I get to the top, I heard Jack Boy main and put me in around. Jack Boy, what is this? They talking <laughs> <laughs> I don't even want to say with it. So they talking about like, oh no, man, we'll we'll see what the battle. They, they talking crazy. I want to see when this battle comes out because I want to see what he's talking about. I, I get Uncle Rob was kind of talking to Rock about it on Fifteen Minutes of Fame, saying something like, "Yo, you know, like the such and such with Fred, and you know what I'm saying, and then a Piper Boy." Like, what? Well, wait a minute, Jack Boy. Man, I thought we was cool. I thought we was cool, Jack Boy. Man. What's your problem? 
Shout out. You know what I'm saying? But shout out to Jack Boy Meg. From what I'm hearing, this is a fire battle. I don't know unless I see it. You know what I mean? So hopefully they end up dropping this battle soon. Shout out to Jack Boy Meg. Shout out to Tay Rock. I want to say that. You know what I mean? When you look at, at Rock, a lot of people got him as a battler of the year. A lot of people got Rum Nitty as battler of the year. The problem with them is that I'm seeing that they they taking some losses. You know what I mean? So I don't know how y'all going to really gauge this at the end of the year. Because I said something like Chef Trez needs to be considered as one of the top five people at uh, for battler of the year. And I'm getting criticism about that on Twitter. People like, oh, you know, like Tay Rock and oh, Rum Nitty. And you know what I'm saying? Like, what you talking about? And all that. But when you look at like a person like Rock, he's lost a few battles this year, a couple battles this year. He lost versus Miss Hustle, and then he lost versus Ab. You know what I'm saying? So, like, and then you got Rum Nitty. He lost versus Ill Mac, and then he lost. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's he's losing, you know, some battles. You know what I mean? And then you got a person like Chef Trez that arguably hasn't lost at all this year. You know, so I don't know how, like, people are going to gauge this at the end of the year. But in my personal opinion, I feel like Chef Trez been putting in work. If you look at the battle between him and Swamp, this is a fire battle. This ain't the only fire battle he had this year. You know what I'm saying? Like, he did really well against Swamp, and Swamp was on one. And he won the second and the third round. You know, Chef Trez, so I don't know. He kind of, he's on a winning streak. If you ask me, him versus, you know, uh, New Jersey Twerk was a good battle. Him versus John, you know, people kind of looking at all this like, yo, Chef Trez, the two-on-two, -two, what he been doing? He's kind of been... Got him in wilding, you know, so I don't know. Shout out to Chef Trez. I do want to say, you know, I think more light needs to be put on him because he's been working a lot, you know what I mean, and putting on good performances. Then you had the Blue Room. You know, I was in the Blue Room. He was battling, uh, I think it was like a show, show off, you know, in the Blue Room. He had a crazy performance, you know what I mean? And then his second round versus Swamp was insane. You know, so I don't know. Like, I don't know what we doing with Chef Trey. I know Hollow to Don, you, you know, we got homecoming coming up. You know, you might want to look at battling Chef, you know, or somebody like that. You know what I mean? Chef Trez is putting in a lot of work. So shout out to Chef. I do want to put respect on your name. You know what I mean? I do want to say this, though, right? I've seen an interview, right? And you got uh, Ra, he's interviewing Briz Rothstein. And I think this this interview is very telling, right? So it's like Ra is interviewing Briz about his religion, you know. And then you know I you know whatever religion you is, shout out to that religion. You know what I mean? I ain't got nothing. I just want to put that out there, disclaimer. Nothing against anybody's religion. Believe what you want to believe. But when I'm watching the interview with Briz, he seems completely different. You know what I mean? The way he talks, the way his obviously like his perspective of life is changing. Like he's involved with it. Mukden punched him into a religion. Wait a minute. I'm sorry, Briz. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But I don't know. Shout out. I'm just saying. <laughs> they ain't what I want. Briz. They ain't what I want to say. Look, I'm just saying he's completely different than what he was. You know, so when I'm looking at this interview, it's like, yo, is he really going to come back to battle rap? And no, yeah, he's outside. He's supporting people that he's cool with, you know, but is he going to get on stage and battle somebody like Mook or battle again? You know, and if he battles again, is it going to be the same type of content? I don't know. He's talking about, yeah, yo, I'm doing this and that for the schools. I'm, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be a better example for people and the kids and you know what I'm saying I'm, I'm eating different I'm trying to be a better person I'm trying you know what I'm and this is what he's he's trying to hammer home you know what I mean like I'm trying to be you know what I mean like different so it's cool you know what I mean like you know what I mean shout out you know you got easy to buy he's Muslim and all that you know what I'm saying shout out you know but I'm wondering like is this gonna affect him as a battler you know what I mean? I'm just curious about that. Shout out to Briz Rothstein. I'm glad, you know, that you you living good. You know what I'm saying? You ain't drinking. You ain't smoking. You, you know what I'm saying? You doing what you're supposed to do. You handling your responsibilities. You trying to be an example, all that. But I'm curious, you know, is this going to affect him, like, in battle rap? You know what I mean? Like, is he going to be willing to battle? You know, so I don't know. Shout out to Briz Rothstein. I highly suggest that y'all go ahead and watch that interview. As far as Kid Slade, I want to say this. I think you got a crazy battle coming up, Kid Slade. 
You got like <laughs> you <laughs> we've kind of been talking about this person a lot. You got a crazy battle coming up, right? So if I'm curious, like, is is URL gonna try to remarket Slay? Like, what's the deal? You got Tay Rock saying, like, yo, basically, he's rocking with Kid Slay now. After all that. You know what I mean? Everybody talking about they ain't rocking with Kid Slay, such and such and such. They ain't battling him, and then Suge battled him. And I ain't battling him, and all these people battle. You know what I mean? So I don't know what's going to end up happening, but you got Kid Slay, who's arguably haven't lost. I seen that he just battled Cortez. Cortez is telling me he won. I see interviews. Kid Slay saying he won. You know, but his performance was so crazy that Rock went public and basically said that, yo, Slay's going to keep getting booked. He's going crazy in battles. You know what I'm saying? He's basically supporting him. So I'm curious to see what the URL is going to do with him. Because y'all ain't really got... This is an interesting situation. Because, you know, Rock kind of... That whole... That paperwork situation kind of messed up a lot of his momentum. You know, so I'm curious, like, what y'all going to do? Or y'all just going to, like, give him battles every once in a while? Or y'all going to try to rebrand or try to remarket him? Or is he able to be remarketed? You know what I mean? That's what I want to ask y'all in the comment section below. You know what I'm saying? Is this something that y'all interested in or not? You know what I'm saying? But I don't know. Y'all tell me what y'all think. Lux! You gonna have to come outside. I don't care what you say. You gotta come outside. I mean, not for Rum Nini. I mean, he kind of been losing. Shout out to Rum. But you gotta come outside, bro. You know what I mean? I don't know what URL doing. You got homecoming coming up. You know what I'm saying? Y'all just open y'all eyes. You can kind of tell who's going to be on homecoming. Homecoming's coming up. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know. You know, I think we need some announcements. Y'all need to say something. You know what I mean? People got to book flights. You know what I mean? <laughs> People got to book flights. URL, give everybody notice. Don't be telling us a week ahead of time when homecoming going to be. Or are y'all changing or rescheduling it? You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm curious about. You know what I'm saying? But Tay Rock, unblock me or else. Shout out. You know what I'm saying? But I'm out. Come rate, subscribe. Let me know what y'all think about that. I'm just a blogger. That's it. One out of many. You know what I'm saying? With an opinion. But I do want to say this before I leave. You know, I even though I got Rum Nitty losing, you know, a couple, you know what I mean? Like the, you know what I'm saying? A couple, battles, whatever. You know, even though he's been losing some battles and been in this crazy situation between him and Foots, I do feel like he is a vital part of battle rap and very important and highly respected. You know, because it's one thing to get out battle and you may, you know what I mean? You on the road, things are going to happen. You know what I mean? Battle and lose and deal with criticism and deal with all that. But that's, that's what makes a warrior. You know, you got people like Lux. Shout out to Lux. But he ain't getting in the field, you know, and he lost to Geechee Gotti. And he had like a subpar battle with Sue Surf. He won, but it wasn't that good, you know. And you got somebody that's constantly giving you A1 content. You might not win every battle, but he's giving A1 content, you know what I'm saying? And I think that has to mean something, you know. And for URL to, to have done that to him, I don't care what nobody says or who want to ride with URL and all that. For them to have done this to him, because that's what y'all did. Y'all wasn't clear about what all oh, this seemed like a setup. Y'all need to give him lux. That's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? You might want to give him lux. That's all I want to say. But I'm out. Comment, rate, subscribe. Let me know what y'all think about that. Peace.